Hello, today we made it to Castello Gandolfo and it's just a day trip maybe about 40 minutes away from Rome from Termini station and we're gonna explore this nice little town so it was clearly goth laundry day today going to find our way around across the street see what we find I'm kind of craving some seafood what about you Wow, there is some seafood right there for you too. <laughs> seafood. <laughs> We're at Lago Albano, which we learned is a former volcano. volcano. A form of volcano. I guess this big ring here is where like the lava was probably or the the crater opening. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Well last time it exploded it probably sunk in on itself and then just filled in. Yeah so last time it exploded it probably s caved in on itself and sunk in. Quote of Kristen. <laughs> um, source, all right, yes. Chicago style bibliography. Uh, <laughs> and yeah, this is pretty awesome though. Look at this view, it's super ultra beautiful. Cheers. We cheated the system and now we are going to Marino. <laughs> We're supposed to only be able to go from Casello. Um, what is it? Gandolfo. Gandolfo to Rome and back, but we took an extra stop. Sorry. <laughs> RIP. RIP, Christian. <laughs> Romanella Rosso. If you ever go to Marino, this is the only place you can actually get it. Romanella Rosso in Marino, Italy is one of the best wines that I've had. It's actually really good. It's sweet, but not too sweet, but it's like it's frizzante. It's frizzante, it's bubbly. And it's just a, it's a good mix of dry wine and bubbly wine and sweet wine. Like it's all kind of compacted into this little bottle here. And let's discuss how cheap it is. Yes, okay. Let's talk about the cheapness. So the first place we got it for five euro. The second place we got it for four euro. Third place we got it for three euro. So basically, Marino is a scammy ass city. But <laughs> we recommend it. Merry Christmas. <laughs>